The forum brought together Libyans from Misrata, Zintan, Beida, as well as chiefs of tribes from East Libya, along with local representatives of Tuareg and Amazing. According to the organizers, the meeting was meant to ease political tensions among different groups. We emphasize the following points. First of all, the unity of Libyan territory. Second, the consensus of the sanctity of the Libyan blood. And third, the formation of national unity government based on the consensus that would represent all Libyans. The head of the preparatory committee, Suleiman Mohammed, stressed on the need to come up with a clear roadmap to help solve Libya's problems. First, the fact that all these sides are gathering around one table in one room is an achievement in itself. What will please the Libyans is when we will issue a clear roadmap with a specific time frame and specific mechanism with joint security forces that would open up the roadblocks and protect the people and protect their lives. The next meeting is scheduled to take place in Libya in Bayada city in about a month's time. A parliament set up in Libya to rival the elected assembly has suspended UN-sponsored peace talks because of what it called fresh acts of violence from the country's recognized government. Last week, the United Nations brought together in Geneva some of Libya's rival factions in an attempt to negotiate an end to their fight for control of the country four years after the ousting of the late Muammar Gaddafi. Susan Mongeli, CCTV.